In this video, we're going to be learning how to find the DNS information of any website using the dig command. When you type a domain name in your browser like facebook.com, your computer does not know what facebook.com is. The domain name facebook.com is translated into an IP address so that your computer knows where to connect. This process of translating the domain name into an IP is done by DNS. DNS stands for domain name system and DNS server is responsible for translating the domain into an IP. If we query the DNS server, we can gather information about the domain like the IP address of the website, the mail server IP, the name servers and so much more and we can do this with the tool called dig. This is the first step a hacker does to gather information of a website. So let's see how to use the dig command in our Kali Linux. So I'm in my Kali Linux right now. I will first open the terminal and type the command dig space the name of the domain that i want to gather the information for simplicity i will type google.com as you can see i get output with few information let's go over this output one by one the first thing that we're interested in is the question section so this is the question i asked the dns server my question included the domain name which is google.com and since i did not give any option dig will by default resolve the a record a record means that when the domain name is translated into an ipv4 address so that's what we can see in the answer section that the IPv4 address of google.com is this one. And if I scroll down, I can see the name servers and also the IP of the name servers. I can see the time it required to query the DNS server, which is 16 millisecond. This is the IP of my own DNS server. And this is the port number. We know that DNS works in port 53. And this is the time when I queried the DNS server. So that is how to find the IP address of any website. If you just want to query the name servers, then type the command dig space the domain name space the type of record that you want to query. Since I want to query the name servers, I will type in capital NS and press enter. I can see in the question section, I queried the name servers and in the answer section, I get the name servers with the IP. If you want to find the mail servers, then type the command dig the domain, which in this case is gmail.com space MX. MX stands for mail exchange and then press enter. In the question section, I can see I queried the mail exchange records and in the answer section, I get the name of the mail servers. I also get the name servers with the IP. You can also resolve an IP address to a domain name. This process of resolving an IP address to a domain name is called reverse DNS lookup. So type the command dig space dash x space the IP address that you want to resolve. This is the IP address of the Google DNS server and I will now press enter. In the question section, I can see I asked for PTR record. In the answer section, I get the answer which is dns.google. I again get the name servers with their IP. Now let's see how to get all the records that are associated with the domain. But first, if you want to get comfortable with the Kali Linux command line, then click the first link in the description box and you will get the complete Kali Linux cheat sheet for beginners. This cheat sheet has all the commands that you need to become comfortable with the terminal. So if you get stuck, you can quickly refer to this cheat sheet. So click the first link in the description box to get this cheat sheet. Now to get all types of record that are associated with a specific domain, type the command dig the domain name space any in capital letter and press enter. I can see in the question section, I said to give me any type of record and in the answer section, I get the HTTPS, the A record, the NS, the SOA. So that is how to get all types of record with a particular domain. You can also query the DNS information from the domain server that you like. So if you do not want to use the default local DNS server, then type the command dig space at mark the IP of the DNS server that you want to use. I will use the Google public DNS server and the domain name that you want to query. This time I will query facebook.com and I can see the IP of facebook.com in the answer section. And if I check the server, I can see my DNS server was Google public DNS server. Finally, if you do not want any extra information, only the IP address or the key information, then type the command dig the name of the domain space plus short and press enter. And as you can see, I get the IP address only and no other information. So this is how to use the dig command in Kali Linux. If you like this video and want to watch more content related to Kali Linux or ethical hacking, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.